episode of Global Policy. I'm your host, Judefson. If you've been following the news, you may have heard about x -Gratia. Well, here is everything you need to know about it. What is x -Gratia? According to the Oxford Dictionary, the word ex gratia refers to a payment given as a favour or from a sense of moral obligation rather than because of any legal requirement. From this definition, it means that what is popularly referred to as ex gratia in Ghana is a gift from the citizens to Ghanaian presidents, members of parliament and certain public sector workers. Based on this definition of an ex gratia being a gift, if people such as members of parliament want an ex gratia, all they need to do is to secure the vote as an MP and make it through four years in parliament because the definition clearly indicates that an ex gratia does not require the recipient to achieve any accomplishment since it is given as a moral obligation rather than because of any legal requirements. So the recipient of an ex gratia can literally decide to sleep on the job and still receive the payment. However, the standard definition of an ex gratia is slightly different from what Ghanaians popularly refer to as ex gratia. Unlike the standard definition of an ex gratia being a payment given to someone as a favour, the payments given to the so-called ex gratia recipients in Ghana are legal requirements to be paid according to Article 71 of the 1992 Constitution. In fact, there is actually no mention of ex gratia in the 1992 Constitution. Anyway, Article 71 of the Constitution basically states that certain public sector workers, who are often referred to as Article 71 office holders, are legally entitled to a retirement package or retirement benefits after serving their time in office. Who are Article 71 office holders? They include the President, the Vice President, the Speaker of Parliament, the Chief Justice and Justices of the Supreme Court. The rest are Members of Parliament, Ministers of State, Political Appointees, and public servants with salaries charged to the Consolidated Fund but enjoying special constitutional privileges. As you know, these videos are meant to simplify complex issues for the ordinary media consumer who is not really interested in politics, so we read through documents and present the facts. But since this issue of ex gratia is a controversial issue in Ghana, we have attached a link below in the video description for those who would like the full legal details of what the entire Article 71 of the 1992 Constitution says. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.